What is going on guys, welcome back to another episode on the Chaos Craft server. Um, last time we left off, we was in a cave, we was with Zion, we was going on a big big caving session and um, yeah, we decided not to record the last bit of the caving session but live stream it so if you enjoyed them last two episodes of us being in a cave and you want to see how it ended up, go and watch the live stream which is up on my channel now, I think it's in two parts and we finished off the caving session, I'll show you all the cool stuff that I got um, when I get back to my house but a little bit of a change for the start of this episode we are at spawn we are at the xp farm and i've been here for a little while because i want to finally get some of the tools that i wanted to repair i wanted to get them all fixed up and sorted out because my tools were getting pretty beat up so i needed to try and sort them out and the reason i'm here and i know some of you are saying you've got your spider farm but honestly guys we'll get to that spider farm in a minute it is annoying i'll explain to you what happened uh, a little bit later in the video but let me start with this you can see I've got 29 levels and I'll show you what I want to repair these diamonds this is what we got from caving so there's a little sneak peek of all the stuff that we got um, what have I repaired so far I repaired my efficiency 5 pick I think and I, re I repaired this one here that I did in another episode yeah so I've got three really good picks there not sure what I'm going to do with these three yet um, I am going to be combining some of these tools right here so this is what I'm going to do now so I'm going to get all the XP that I need I've been doing it for a little while so we've got here I want to try and see if I can put smite on that so I'm going to put that in my inventory I don't think I can I think that's something that's not possible oh there's something I wanted to mention that happened a little while ago when I was trying to combine stuff, I was trying to combine an iron pick and a diamond pick. I totally didn't realise, and you guys screamed at me in the comments, but yeah, I realise now, I was derping out, it was stupid. Um, these two, I want to make this sword here a looting three sword, because then that would be an awesome sword as well. And I want to combine these two bows, because then that will give me a power three bow. I think, yeah, power three, and I want to put flame on this bow as well, and that will give me an awesome bow there. So that is pretty much all the things I'm gonna separate them a little bit so I don't get confused yeah that is pretty much all the things I want to do so let's go and see how much levels I need for all this because I'm not sure how much it's going to take so to put oh no other way around to put that to looting three is gonna cost me 13 levels which isn't bad it's pretty good um, so for these two bows that's gonna cost me 13 or if I put it around the other way nine that's gonna cost me nine levels to get that to power three so that's pretty good i'm going to do that last because that's probably the one i need the least um can i put smite on this no it doesn't oh no it doesn't give me smite so them two cannot go together so let's go and put that back in the chest and i'm pretty sure i can put flame on this can i yeah um yeah i'm pretty sure i'm gonna have like it's not going to take me long to do all that stuff so let's do some of that now I want to put this back so I don't I want to repair this sword because I do like that sword but that book is pretty much useless and that needs repairing what's this one this was that a bane of arthropods yeah anyway let's do these so which which one was nine levels was it this that was 13 all right that's 13 levels right there to give that a loot, looting three so let's do that what did that duplicate the sword or something oh i thought oh the anvil broke damn so um <laughs> the anvil broke let's go up here because i know there's an anvil up the top i've got 16 levels and that was 13 levels right cool so let's go and do that quickly i want to come back down here so what i might do i think i'm going to go and grab one of these anvils over here why can't i sprint and put it down there because I don't think anyone actually uses the anvils over there and we might as well keep it down there because that is where everyone enchants their stuff I wish I wish I had a uh, spider spawner oh what are you doing zombie I wish I had a spy uh, not spider spawner what I'm talking about I've got a spider spawner I wish I had a skeleton spawner near my house because that skeleton farm honestly is one of the best xp farms I've ever found my spider spawner is just such a fail and it's not a fail because of me it's just, I don't know, spiders just seem to be really glitchy. So let's go and, let's take this. And let's go and put it down there. But guys, there's another thing I wanted to talk about. And if some of you didn't know, we have a new member on the server. Um, 
you guys know we're always looking for members to put on the server and you know it's a youtuber server so um, we take our time to try and get the right people to put on the server people that will benefit the server and will benefit from being on the server as well so it kind of goes both ways um, the new member his channel will be in the description and he is called Anthony and his Minecraft name Minecraft name is ID activate yeah so go and check him out he'll be on the server he's going to start doing episodes pretty soon um, I think he's going to take the tunnel I'll, I'll show you in a sec what tunnel he's going to take but let's go back to this and I'm pretty sure this was nine or something ten why has that got why has it gone up now oh well I've got ten levels so that's giving me an awesome bow there I can even do this right oh no it was it was nine right cool so we've got a looting three sword and we've got that bow which is pretty good um let's put this bow back in here which is good i want to put that sword back in there um i want to see how much um, i'm going to do these two later because i'm pretty lame to be honest i want to see how much diamonds it's going to take for me to repair like this stuff here because what i might do i might just cut and get some more XP and then repair them so it's done with 36 too expensive is it worth repair, repairing repair is it worth repairing that <laughs> is it worth repairing that for 36 levels I don't think so to be honest with you I think this pick is worth it though a fortune 3 so let's do this 36 too expensive I don't know I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna leave oh no I need a shovel definitely need a shovel Right, I can't do that. 37. Hmm. Two of them is going to be too expensive, right? Yeah. I'm not sure. I think I might just create some new ones and just enchant them level 30. But yeah. I'm going to leave these for now. It's not really worth it. I'll keep this sword on me until it breaks. Well, I've got a pretty decent sword there. Um, let's try and get some more levels. I only need a few more. Let me show you guys if how this works for those of you who haven't seen it. Oh, the light was the light was off. Why wasn't they spawning? Let's try and get some skeletons there quickly. And get a potion out of here. All this armor here is what I got from just waiting around. I only need like what two levels? Three levels? Come on, skeletons. Spawn for me. Spawn for me. Why are they not? Where are they? Hello. Oh, I think some spawned there. There you go. So what they do, I actually built this spawner, guys, and it took me forever to try and work out, work things out. That's why I've never, ever done a tutorial on it, because it took me ages to build this because I kept getting it wrong and all different stuff like that. Like the redstone, you guys saw me when I was trying to build my hidden door, how the redstone went with that. So this took me forever to build. But honestly, it is really, really good. Really good. So you've got lights here. Turn it off and on. Behind here is the redstone. Let me try and show you. Oh no, this redstone's different. Ah, oh, that's right. Someone broke it and then they repaired it. So they did the redstone. Slightly different to me. I think this crusher is pretty much the same as the crusher I use for the spider spawner. So yeah, so if you if you want to know how to do that, just watch the spider spawner video. And basically, I think they're just in a little um, square. A nine by nine square you got water in one corner water in the other and it kind of pushes them down to this point here and then you can kill them i think that is enough to get me to level nine i think i need to do that so now you crush them like that it gets them down to half a heart so you wait here usually you'd wait here till you've got about a hundred skeletons or something like that and then oh that guy is not going to die but these guys will die here so i throw that on them and it gets you all your xp it works really well so let's do the last one of these two might as well get them out of the way i do not want to carry them diamonds around with me so i'll put them back in my end chest level nine uh was it this way level nine yeah level nine level nine power three bow cool let's put that back in this chest so yeah we're getting some good stuff now we're getting some good stuff uh, i want to put you back in there as well so let's make my way back to my house and I want to kind of show you what's going on with the spider spawner because I made some changes and it work, it's working a little bit better. You guys would have seen the problems I had in the live stream. It's working a little bit better, but still not perfect. Like the spiders were escaping. I had 80 spiders in there earlier. I started to crush them and they started just escaping. 
for no reason. They just escaped out of the trap and they nearly killed me. I was, I had like 30 levels as well. I was near enough raging. I would have raged if I um, died. I broke that glowstone. I need to replace that. But anyway, the new guy on the server. Yeah, go and check out his channel. Uh, and Anthony's corner. I think he's going to take this tunnel. I don't think he's started on his never tunnel yet. I think his episode will be coming out soon. Um, you, you, you guys will see it. I'm pretty sure because I know you guys are pretty loyal to the Chaos Craft people. But yeah, let's go back to my house. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, about um, I deactivate's channel. Yeah, I deactivate MC. Link will be in the description. Um, yeah, he's got some good stuff, guys. Go and check out his channel. I'm looking forward to seeing his first episode. I really am. Um, we're, we're definitely going to do some more group stuff soon, 100%. We, we was all in a group call on Skype recently to introduce him to the server, gave him a tour and stuff, and we're talking about going to kill the Wither, going to kill the Dragon. I know Gliss wants to do an Ender Farm in the end, so we need to go and kill that Dragon, so expect that to happen pretty soon, definitely. Um, I need to, I've never ever finished that off down there. I need to go and finish that off. Yeah, but I can't wait till we go and kill the Ender Dragon. I think it's going to be really, really good. Definitely. Well, everybody hates this tunnel thing. <laughs> I, I can't think how many people have, like, nearly died in here. It would be funny. I can't wait. I should put, like, hoppers underneath. No, I should put... I was going to say I put helpers underneath the lava so the items will go through, but that was just stupid because they'll just burn. But anyway, we're back at my house, and I want to show you what is going on with the spider spawner. Let me go and get some blocks because... I was thinking about building some stuff, but I'm not even sure I'm going to have some time. Last couple of episodes, guys, we've not really done much, have we? We've had a lot of adventuring episodes. I think we went on Gliss's house at tour, and then we went caving. Um, I can't wait to upgrade to 1.7, to be honest with you, because I just, I don't know, I want to go and explore the new biome. Since 1.7 come out, I've not even, well, I've not even played it. I've not even played it once. And I want to go and see the new biomes, maybe even, like, because I'm going to have to go far to get some new biomes, because as you guys know, this map was generated in, like, 1.3. So, we're going to have to go pretty far to get new biomes. So, I'm thinking, maybe, should I start a new base? Just, just a little base in the new biomes or something. Link up the portals, get some stuff down there, I don't know. I'm thinking I might do something like that, just to mix it up a little bit, because I feel like, oh, are you kidding me? I've got no planks. Did you mix it up a little bit? So it's not we're not always in this house. Yeah, that'll do. I'll just take that. Need to chop down some trees again as well. But yeah, um yeah, I'm thinking about mixing it up just a little bit. I don't know what I'm doing today, guys. I'm just keep having a mind blank when I'm talking, I'm getting distracted so easily. It's crazy. Sometimes you just have them days, you know. <laughs> you just you just lose your train of thought and it's happening a lot to me today, definitely. But yeah, I can't wait. I, I really want to get some hardened clay. So finding the mes Mesa biome or me Mesa biome, I think it's called. I can't wait to go and find one of them. But let me show you what's working with here. This might look a little bit different. I kind of like put the snow and stuff around here. I put half slabs underneath there and on the roof of the spawner as well. Like up there, you can't see. And it's kind of like making them go down a little bit better. But the problem was, they were like glitching out around this area and they seem to be spawning really slow. Let me try and go in over here, see if I can show you what I actually did. Um, it's around here. Let's go in here. Um, yeah, I'll put a block down there. As you can see, I put half blocks across there. So they seem to like getting stuck up in this area so the half blocks kind of push them down and see how he's getting stuck under the spawner there as well that seems to happen a lot as well and on multiplayer they just kind of glitch look, look he just like jumped there let's see him jump and then he come back there they do that a lot and that is happening so much on this spider spawner i've lost a piece of cobblestone damn it let me get a piece that's happening a lot so i'm not sure i'm really not sure what to do because I, uh, with a XP farm, you want to kind of AFK around it. So with this one, I'm, I have to keep like moving around to try and get them to come down here and stuff like that. But yeah, earlier I was waiting here for ages and had about 80 spiders there. So I turned the light, I put that up so none of them get in. I turned the lights on and then I squashed them here and they, they keep, they jump out over this area here. So if I have like more than 50 in there, they all start like popping out of the area, so it's a pretty ineffective XP farm. There's no point having an XP farm like this with um with just 
with just like 10 mobs in there because what's the point in that i could go out on my uh what's it called my planes biome over there and do and kill 10 mobs pretty easily at night time so not i'm not sure what i'm going to do with this yet um i was thinking about maybe just um uh, maybe just uh, digging this out and seeing how I can edit this and stuff. Like, I'm thinking maybe bring this down a level. I don't know. I don't know, guys. It's pretty confusing. But I'm definitely going to have some chest rooms around here. Maybe around this area here. And just dig this out. I'm not going to dig it out now because it's boring. Um, yeah, I'll dig that bit out down there and just have some chest areas or something. I like this, though. I was trying to keep the same kind of design as my house. You guys know my usual floor design and stuff that I do in my house. I was trying to keep the same theme. This is the lights, the crush, um, the little barrier that stops it, and then the crusher. But other than that, it's okay. I thought it'd be a lot better than what it actually is. Um, yeah, uh, let me... I just want to finish off this roof part. Uh, going to need another staircase going up because... I'm always needing to go up there. So let me do another staircase. Go, oh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Always needing to go up there, so might as well just... Right, that can be my staircase up there for now. So, um, I was thinking, because I don't want the roof to be open like this. I'm just going to do a little bit of this. I was thinking just have it like that. Is that going to work? Yep. like that and then just I don't know whether to have the snow just being on this level or having it up one level where did what the where did you come from oh, no not with an arrow not with an arrow right there you go oh that sword was good yeah, I was thinking maybe having it up one level there. I'm not sure. I really am not sure. Let's try and do this quickly. See what it looks like. Um, let's dig out this part. I know. I need a shovel, guys. Badly. I don't think I've had a shovel for like over 10 episodes now. Let's get rid of this. And dig this out. Can I put a torch back up over here? Yep. So this is what I'm thinking. Oh, not cobblestone. So like this. And whoop, like, ah, oh, I'm just failing today, guys. Oh, my God. <laughs> right, anyway. Um, yeah, guys, I have been talking quite recently, and if you was watching the live stream, I've been talking about a new up-and-coming furniture video, which I'm going to be doing. And so those of you who have been subscribed to me for a long time, you guys know that is what I started out with. I... When I first started my channel, it was a lot of let's builds and a lot of um, furniture design videos. And I have recently just finished, and it is actually finished, so I've just got to record the video. Um, I finished a furniture design video, so um, yeah, that's going to be recorded pretty soon. So look out for that, and I know a few of you will be excited. And I have also started some work on a let's build. So the, again, the guys that have been subscribed to me for a long time, will know about let's builds because that is what i did <laughs> that is what i did when i first started my channel i was a let's build guy I, I did modern let's builds and stuff like that um i took a bit of a break from it because i don't know it was just building kind of got a bit i got a bit burnt out with building to be honest with you so yeah so but i can't wait to start my new let's build it's just going to be a nice simple house to start off with but i think you guys will like it i just got to find the time to actually record it so yeah but furniture video definitely coming out next week. I'm going to definitely find time to record that. But yeah, guys, I don't know what I prefer. I think think I prefer this one with it being one up. So I have not got a shovel, so I'm going to waste I'm going to waste these snow blocks. This is so annoying. I just I don't I don't want to use a normal shovel. I want like a good enchanted one, so I'm going to have to get a 30 levels and do a really good enchanted one that's what i'm definitely going to do for for my next enchant 100 percent. so let me just dig this out i don't even know how long i've been recording it's probably been a little while uh let me do this 
Right, there we go. This last little bit. I think, guys, after I've done this, I know I've not really done much today, but I just wanted to get them in chants and stuff out the way. Oh, I need to show you what I got, didn't I? I to... Oh, what is wrong with me today? I need to show you what I've got from the caving session. So we're going to run up there. We're going to go and show you what I got with the caving session. And then what I'm going to do, we are going to do shout out. I nearly forgot about shout out, but that's what we're going to do. I like this. I think that looks all right. Maybe I'll run that up to there. Oh, that might look good, actually. Let's do that. Can I put them there? Yeah, I like that. It looks like it's going up from there. I could do that all the way up to the top of the stairs, maybe. Yeah, that's good enough. That would be nothing too fancy for a spider spawner, but yeah. I'm not even too sure if I'm going to 100% continue this spider spawner because it's been such a fail. Nearly killed me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. I'm not glitched out. Yeah, nearly killed me, so I'm kind of mad at the spider spawner, <laughs> so I don't want to finish it. I'm going to neglect it for a little while, see how it feels, and I'll go back to it. But yeah, let me show you all the stuff I got because we went crazy we had like so much stuff of iron and things like that. you guys saw the diamonds i could make out of the diamond blocks um managed to fill up my chest basically with all redstone and then i managed to make all them diamond um diamond all them redstone blocks out of the redstone we had left left over um i think i got about i think the old chest was about there it stopped there and then i got all this iron on top of that i um, got a few stacks of gold as well we've got like a ton of lapis we've got it was just such a good um caving session i still haven't mined all the coal that i got i had to turn everything into coal blocks because i didn't have any chest um any room in my chest and uh, let's put this armor in here that's all the armor i get from the spider spawners but yeah guys it was it was a good haul um I, it's good to go on caving episodes every now and again you know it's they're enjoyable i really do enjoy them i just get addicted to it and i just i when i go i'm the worst caver because i always kind of um just get distracted so easily i'll be like right i'm gonna get that iron and i end up getting lost in the mine shaft and stuff oh and we got horse armor so our horse over here is all kitted up i need to think of names for horses and stuff so guys if you got any names for a horse let me know and we can name this horse in the next episode because this is my best horse my favorite horse he's the fastest one he's got the armor and stuff now so we need to name him definitely so we're going to name him in the next episode probably um yeah guys right i am gonna cut and we are gonna cut back in and we are gonna do shout out i can't even remember what number it is but yeah i'll see you in a minute guys we're gonna do shout out right guys uh we're back with shout out number 37 and i actually failed with the last shout out if you can see dragon pier up there was shout out number 35 and then the mlab or Melab graphics i said number 35 again so mlab graphics sorry about that you are number 36 and this one will be number 37 so this week's shout out goes to mr owen morgue and now mr owen morgue has been a long time subscriber i'm pretty sure because i've seen his name so many times always leaves nice comments and stuff and yeah so i thought he deserved a shout out again this week's shout out is based on uh, the same how as Dragon Peers was with the new kind of YouTube community system. It tells you how much people like your videos and um, subscribe, uh, not subscribe, um, engagement. It's all about engagement, how they comment, like, favorite and stuff like that. So yeah, he's, I always see his name pop up. I actually always see his comments on my videos too. So Mr. Owen Morg, you are shout out number 37. And um, Owen actually has a YouTube channel too. He has like over 300 subs. He does Minecraft uh, mini games, let's plays and tutorials as well. So make sure you go and check out his channel. The link will be in the description. So let's put you in here, Owen, and put your sign up. And let's do this. So shout out number 37. Let's not get this wrong this time. Shout out number 37. If you're wondering why my signs are like this, guys, it's because of the Better Signs mod. I did do a mod review on it, so you can go and check that out. So shout out number 37 goes to Mr. Owen Morg. So yeah, guys, um, I think I'm going to call the episode at end now. We've not really done much. Um, next episode, maybe we might be updating to 1.7 so we might go on a hunt for some new biomes in the next episode i'm not 100 sure i've got to discuss it with everyone on the server see if they want to do the same thing so it's not just my decision as you guys know i like to uh have, i like everyone on the server to make a decision because in my opinion it's it's our server not not just like my server or something like that so yeah we might be on 1.7 in the next episode not 100 sure yet but you guys will find out next week for sure so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this episode and i will see you again in another video